This is video from Air 11 on the ambulance chase that went on for more than an hour. Police say it started at a Kroger grocery store where the suspect appeared to be helping a woman then took off in her car. After that, police say he drove to the east side to fire station number 17 on navigation across the street from the original NIFAS. We saw the, the gentleman pull in in a four-door sedan. He pulled right into the fire station's parking lot, jumped out, ran inside the open bay, jumped in the ambulance, and was gone within a minute. This is surveillance video that witnesses say shows him jumping inside the ambulance and taking off. We had some challenges with the automatic vehicle location on it. The ambulance's GPS system wasn't working, and it took a while for officials to find it. Eventually, a police helicopter spotted it driving along the West Loop, and officers on the ground rushed in to catch up. As the chase continued, the driver turned on to Shepard from Westheimer. Police put out spike strips before the driver passed beneath the Southwest Freeway. Not long after that, it all came to an end along Greenbrier near Rice Village. Another driver was hit when he says he was trying to get out of the way. It wasn't that big of an impact, you know, but I mean, there's some damage to the car, but um, the officer, you know, got out the car with the pistols drawn and everything, told me to move out the way. Police say the man was in crisis. They say he'll be facing charges of automobile theft and felony evading arrest.